Yeah, that's so cool. I can't even think straight. Hello, YouTube. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. My name is Whitney. If you're new here, welcome. So I just wanted to make this little intro because the footage that you're about to see, I did record um, an intro, but it was so bad because I was so cold. My nose was running. I was in shock. So what happened was I was somewhere on I-90 um, going east um, in Washington State. I'm trying to re remember everything, y'all. But I was in Washington State and then I was going to go use the restroom. But my bad luck was this door, the passenger door, doesn't unlock. So it's broken. It doesn't unlock. I don't know why. You can open it from the inside, but you, can, you cannot open it from the outside. So I was trying to get out my truck, me and my co-driver. And then my driver's side was locked. Because when I'm driving, I lock my truck. Okay, so and then there was a pile of snow next to my door. I didn't want to get down the truck and put my feet directly in this big ass pile of dirty snow yeah i was so excited to go outside i was jumping i was like oh my god i'm about to jump in the snow and stuff and then i got down with my camera and stuff recording and then i closed the door behind me and i realized oh my god like i just locked myself out of the truck and my co-driver had already left the truck the, the truck was still running we didn't have a spare key on us, so we, we were just stuck outside. So with that said, I'm gonna let you watch whatever's gonna come after that. And then I hope you guys enjoy it. Make sure you subscribe, do everything that you need to do to support the channel if you do like my content. All right, all right. I am freezing. I am on I-90 in Washington State. I locked myself out of the damn truck. Yeah, that's so cold. I can't even think straight. It's getting dark a little bit. The sun is setting. I called Swift Breakdown and um, I spent about 30 minutes on the line with them. Whew. This one guy, this one dude that answered the phone after maybe three minutes, okay? And I'm sorry, guys. I can't think straight. I'm so cold. And sorry if you see boogers in my nose because my nose is running, okay? So I called I called breakdown and they didn't find anybody to come and rescue us because it's like a breakdown. They're supposed to come, maybe like pop the door or bring a, a key, a general key to unlock the door. No luck. He said he didn't find anybody. It's Sunday night. Yeah, to mention to you guys, it is Sunday. So nobody's entering the phone. There's no company that's entering. No, no loves, Hang J, Pilot, nothing, nothing. And I am probably two hours away from a Swift terminal in Summer, Washington, I think. Guys, I, I don't know what to do, okay? I'm gonna keep y'all updated. I'm waiting for a phone call because he did say that he was gonna send an email or something. Yeah, I am so sorry if you're seeing my boogers and stuff. It is so cold and I feel like my boogers are turning into ice. <laughs> Low key. But my truck is right there. So my truck is right there. There was a pile of snow right here. And then as soon as I got out that way, this truck wasn't here. There was a truck on this side and then a pile of snow because it was maybe a pile of snow like this, maybe bigger. And then I just got out on the passenger side. And then I locked myself out, guys. I literally locked myself out. Yep, that's me. Seriously, guys, look at how pretty this mountain looks. I know my camera is not capturing every detail. You know, it's iPhone, so it's never gonna get it like straight. But it's so pretty out here. I just wish I wasn't outside. That's my only wish, but my trailer is right here. My truck is right here. And then outside, it's pretty. I just hope that they come before it gets dark because it's gonna get hard all right y'all they called me i am sitting next to the vending machine right now um under the light so i can stay warm um they called me and they're telling me that they won't be there for about 60 to 90 minutes 
I hope that they can come before that because it, it is getting dark and it's getting colder. So I really hope that they're gonna come sooner than that. But because it's a drive from where they at, they finally found somebody and I think it's Beacon or something like that. So I'm waiting you guys. I'm gonna keep y'all updated. And once I get in my truck, I'll be able to relax. They are finally here, you guys. Finally, bro. Here's a tow truck right here. Here's my truck. He's gonna get me my truck very soon. So they came after two hours. I waited outside for two hours, you guys. I know some of y'all will be like very negative and stuff, but I stayed positive, y'all, okay? So I can't wait to get inside my truck and get warm and stuff. It was a nice experience. Next time I'll, I'll double check that I have my keys on me and my wallet because it's literally 2 e one So you guys, yeah. I did something for the thumbnail. Hashtag thumbnail. Yeah, that was my thumbnail, you guys. <laughs> oh, I'm so cool, y'all. Y'all, I don't have good service, so I can't even tell you guys what the te temperature is. But... I'm gonna show you the charge. If I wasn't on it up and that thing happened to me, y'all, that would be like $800 to unlock my, my 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 truck. I'm sure there's there's other ways, but since I called my company, they found a company that would come in and open the doors for me, especially on a Sunday night. The sun is um the sun is getting down and stuff. And it was very hard to find somebody. Honestly, I had to wait a long time before somebody could answer the damn phone. But yeah, they're doing the work right now. Here it is, they're doing the 